Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a special guest. I have my partner in crime. This is Derek and he'll be joining me in my shrimp mukbang. So we have head on shrimp with some corn on the cob and then some potatoes in there. Alrighty, so let's begin. here if you need it. Okay. Yeah, um, I'm still learning how to set up for these mukbangs. It's really hard to find the perfect position for the food and us. down in there. All in the bottom? Mm -hmm. So I got this shrimp from my favorite place. It's called Little New Orleans. Um, my favorite. I like it with the head on. And I don't. Yeah, nobody else does. I eat them for everyone else. I just dipped it in some Cajun <coughs> hot sauce like liquid that they make there. It's really spicy. I don't usually get corn. Let's be honest, I just got it to make it look pretty. I do like corn. Yeah, like, I think this is the first time I've had it. From there? Mm-hmm. It's pretty good. Is it good? Yeah, I, I smelt mean, it on the way home. It's really sweet. It smells sweet. <laughs> but I usually just do my um potato. head on mm -hmm, head on shrimp with the potato and call it a day. They already know my order. I go there way too much. They're a little cheap on the butter this time, huh? I know. The heck is that? I don't know. Because they filled the whole container with the butter. But they do their best. I don't know if I already said this, guys, but if you know how to set up for mukbangs, please let me know. I have a tripod. I don't know what to do. Because this is not comfortable. Good old kitchen table. Our heads would be cut off there. Mm. 
<laughs> what does that mean? Yeah. Some garlic <coughs> on my knee. How many potatoes? Two whole ones. Hmm. I have to make sure to say whole because sometimes they play me. Put what? Halves? Yeah. I'd like to clarify it. But one of the guys there, he already knows my order. As soon as I put my order in, he knows who it is. Because you're the only one that eats the eggs. Mm. Really good. This Cajun sauce. comes to peeling these shrimp, you gotta pe like you gotta work to peel it. I swear, we make them we make them at home. It peels practically peels itself. Yeah, because they're deveined. Are they? And they taste different because they're deveined. The texture is different. I think it's just as good. It's not better than this, but it's, it's good. It works for me. Who makes the at-home shrimp? Who makes it? Uh, Walmart. <laughs> Don't play. When you make them at home, mm -hmm. it tastes just as good. Or... So last time, he loved it. Best shrimp he'd ever had. Don't play. Best shrimp I ever had? Best shrimp we ever had at home. <laughs> I don't know where the best shrimp I ever had. That was, it was really good. I like it. Because I could down like two pounds of myself. Because it just peels so easy. These, I got to really... You gotta take the legs off. We're having trouble because we had it here for so long, sitting, trying to set up. Rookie, you can say. So they're all like. We're just so close to each other. Aww. I hate eating this way side by side. I really don't like it. I feel weird talking and like. It's her thing. Uh, to me, it doesn't matter. Where I came from. <laughs> We didn't even sit at a dinner table. <laughs> we just ate at the, on the couch, in our rooms, wherever, every other night. That's because you guys were boys. Just like boys. Just your mom and boys. Yeah, mom would cook, and we would be there. Ain't no serving each other. It's just food is, food is ready. Come grab a plate, and you eat wherever the heck you please. Trying to peel this one shrimp. Oh, there goes the tail. <laughs> Good job. I see that some people eat the legs or whatever they are. I don't like that. It's crunchy. You get some old bear. 
I gave it to you. Oh. So guys, today <clears throat> thought about talking about pet peeves of your significant other that you may have. So drop them down low, let us know, and you'll hear all about ours. Or just things that, you know, your partner does and you notice and they probably don't. Whatever. Yeah, your pet peeves, huh? <clears throat> hmm? Farting in my face. <laughs> I never do that. <laughs> you did that just the other day. In your face? I was like walking. Okay. No, if I sat down on you, on your head, and I farted, then you'd have a reason to be upset. That's nasty. You know how many times my brother did that to me? No, how many? I lost count. <laughs> Anything? You? My pet peeves are I take the trash out. And every time I come home and see the trash outside of the door, I want to When was the last the time you saw it outside of the door? And throw it at you. When was the last time you saw it outside of the door? First of all, you guys should know that he's a, a dramatic ago. person. No, that's not true. I have not taken it out in the trash, out in the front. Mm -mm. Not recently, you're right. If I don't go anywhere, and if I'm inside all day with the kids, because it was summer, why am I going to leave <laughs> and just go take the trash out? First of all, second of all, when I do go out, I take it, and sometimes I do even take it out of the trash can and tie it up for you and leave it in front of the door, not outside, in front of the door. So don't play, because you're not the only one who does Look, it. I'm I'll have saying, it ready for you before you leave. I'm just saying, when I come home and see it, that's my pet peeve, that's all I'm trying to say. Yeah. But you've been on top of it lately, and... I don't know, I guess you've been taking the trash out, because I, I took it out today, but... I know that's a mission, you know, up the three flights of stairs. Mm-hmm. But you can manage. If I don't go anywhere, I'm not going to get in the car and just out the trash. Right. Didn't you say the maintenance guys knocked on the door one time and said something about the trash being outside? Yes. So I haven't taken it outside. Good. Duh. What are you trying to prove right there? Oh, no. I was just wondering. Okay. Well, let's see. We can't have it out there. <laughs> what else? It's against the rules, you know. Renters. Sweet potato. <clears throat> Where are you going So like when we get out of the shower, like when we shower together, it's funny because I love to like open the shower curtains open. <laughs> and then you'll open it up. Yeah man, that, that outside that shower would be like an ice bar. I just like to get out, you know? I like to dry off before I even step out of it. Well, yeah, I dry off too, but like... I want to be dry, like, and then like... It's hot. I do my feet. It's not that hot. It's cold when you get out. Like, how are you hot? That doesn't even make sense. I know. I just, I don't know. It's just instinct. And you like open the door instantly and like have all the cold come in, like... 
don't know. Ain't nobody trying to be freezing the minute they get out the shower. That's my first thought. Some days, it'll be hot. But in our house, our apartment, we keep that AC on 73. It's mm -hmm. cold in here. All the time. I remember some days we used to just get straight out the shower and even put a towel. It'd be hot enough to do it. That's in grandma house. Grandma don't put the AC on. We don't have AC. <laughs> <laughs> we got heat. We don't have AC. <laughs> like we live in Columbia or something. Yeah. That's a little up north. Though. That's it. That's the thing. Oh, wait, you talking about your grandma or my grandma? My grandma. Um, your grandma? No, nah, so grandma be good. Yeah, but she used to put it up to like 90, I swear. No way. <laughs> Not friendly? <laughs> yeah, that's a different story. Girl was suffering. Too hot. Y'all getting an argument over mashed potatoes. No, we did. Couple of times. I don't even remember that story. It, was, it happened a number a couple of times. <laughs> Tell me one. Tell us one. One. Um. Well, I can remember it quite a few times rather than just one time. Okay. Well. It always ends up being the time where you boil the potatoes. Uh huh. And then you're like, I don't, I don't want to mash them. You mash them. <laughs> Or you'll be like, I don't even want to ma make mashed potatoes because I, I don't like mashing them. <laughs> That's true, okay. So what? Mind you, this is years back, not recently. So they food. Recently. Yeah, we bought a masher. You went and got yourself a little gadget. And who, know, and who knew her favorite thing in the world was mashed potatoes at that time. She was just mashing and mashing Every away. Day. You got you, you want me to make mashed potatoes, hon? Yeah, alright. I got I got them on the mash. Can't have seafood or shrimp without my cola. <laughs> Any more potatoes, or did you eat them all? I ate mine. There was only two, like two pieces. I only had one. Uh, I only saw three pieces. So what else bothers you about me? Um, what else bothers me, you, um, me, I don't know. I'm sure there's plenty of things on my side. I just can't think of them right now. <coughs> oh, excuse me. I don't really want this kind of smoke right now, to be honest. Think you're, you know, great in every which way you are. Oh, you just. So also, sick. I have to fart. <laughs> oh. He's not gonna do that, guys. No, I won't eating. do it. Yeah. Because you have that, your that, snack. That and would you're be rude. Eating, you're eating with us. That would be rude. Because that's what this is all but about. But they also say don't hold in your flatulence. Because if you hold in that flatulence, it's gonna upset your stomach. Because that would be. By the way, small shout out to Corey Ball. 
Thank you very much for shouting me out. You're so sweet. Um, I think I've learned a few things from you. I might start the whole shouting out thing. I mean, thank you to my um, recent, like, 10 subscribers. But I'm following you back, I think. All of you. That way we can grow together. I've been slacking because I just had a new addition to the family. I had a niece come into this world August 13th. So we've been busy there. But Baby fever. Mm, no, that's what she's for. Though I did want to have four kids total. Yeah, but... What? Now. What? <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty much set on that. <laughs> yeah. Why four kids? Because that way no one's left out. Two, that's sweet, yeah. You know, they have each other. Sometimes they'll dislike each other in the future. Three, mm -mm. One, two are going to bully one. And then four, it's perfect match. Because they're going to get tired of each other. The two get tired of each other, so they can swap to the other two. Exactly. The more, the merrier. But we're not having any more. Oh, I know. That's why we got ne nieces and nephews. Mm-hmm. Plenty of kids. <laughs> and we have the puppy. We do have the pup. The puppy pup pup. He's a singing pup, too. Mm-hmm, that's the pup of the house. Mm hmm He's so nosy. That Cajun. You guys want to hear him sing? Oh, God, no. Who's the pup? Puppy. Who's your pup in the house? Who's getting excited because they think... Who's your pup we love? They think they're going to get some food. Sing, puppy, sing. <laughs> One. <laughs> two. <laughs> He likes it. his favorite song is Happy Birthday. Rain, don't knock the camera over. Who's <laughs> <laughs> up? Happy birthday. <laughs> That's just the sound. Okay, pup. Okay, okay. Y'all, he loves to sing. Yeah, but instead. Let me give him a little piece. He just, you know. Shrimp is good for that. Killed them. everybody's ears. Rest in peace to headphone users, okay? Because <laughs> his bark is angry. And treacherous. He's got a grown ass word. man voice. It's pretty ridiculous. Where's the pup? Ooh. No more. Go lay down. He's like, man, I earned my damn shrimp. He sure did. Go lay down. Oh, I closed this cage by accident. I forgot. <sighs> I'm getting full. Yeah. I kind of want to. Because we took too long to eat them. Yes. I didn't put it in the microwave. I say enough. next time we cook at home. Yeah, we could do that. <laughs> we can get the crab. Oh, look at that cute smile. <laughs> Hey guys, as you can tell, so we no longer have the food in front of us because the camera shut off. Ding dong, rookie move. Um, so I hope you guys did enjoy. Hey Rain, quiet down. Hey, hey, stop. Go lay down. <laughs> so. <laughs> I don't know, I guess this just turned into a vlog. What? What? What do you have to say? We really can't be next to each other, can we? <coughs> Stop. <coughs> hey. <coughs> I know, I love you too, puppy. Alright, Daddy, come on, uh, let's finish this. Oh, man. Come on. Alright, let me collect myself, man. I can't.
<laughs> he doesn't like it when we're next to each other. So, back to it. So, if you guys have any pet peeves or any, <laughs> anything that bothers you about your significant other, just let us know down in the comments. So be sure to like, subscribe, and share. <laughs> Be sure to hit that bell notification so you can see how jealous this pup is in the upcoming videos. It just has to be about the pup, doesn't it? Alright guys, thanks so much for watching. Until next time.